Hi everybody, I'm Sips. Welcome to part 28 of my Orcs Must Die playthrough. And uh, today we're off to the pit, which is the uh, which is the next level in the playthrough, which unfortunately I've already done. Um, I got four skulls when I first tried it, but I had some troubles. Um, well, I made a couple of stupid mistakes, but those stupid mistakes were because uh, my keyboard, for some reason, started uh, auto-strafing to the right. I couldn't get my guy to, uh, to, to stop doing that. And uh, it made for the last 10 minutes of the video um, Pretty, pretty awful watching. So I've decided to redo this. I'm going to go for five skulls this time. Uh, I think I've got a pretty good tactic uh, for this level. So um, let's jump into the pit. Um, try it out. And hopefully we'll be able to get out of the pit. It's not a very deep pit, which is uh, which is good. So uh, so there we go. Okay, it's a, uh, it's a pretty small level. Um, it's got three doors along the back here. Which they all start pouring out of eventually all the uh, all the bad guys. Got a portal in the middle here, which leads up to this one rift, which we're going to um, try to defend uh, from up here. Going to um, get some uh, some stuff set up in here and in here to kill them, and uh, and we're going to get some Steve set up this this episode as well. Back here to uh, to help us sort of defend uh, this area too. Uh, not too many though, but uh, let's see what we're up against. We got fast running bastards. We've got uh, sapping bastards. <laughs> we've got these goddamn bastards. We've got heavily armored bastards. We've got orc warriors, which uh, I can't call bastards because I, I love them and uh, they're quite cute. And uh, we've got crossbow orcs. Plus, we've got these uh, these fire ogres, which which also are bastards. Um, like I said, I think I've got a pretty good tactic for this one. I haven't really tried it yet, but uh, let's see how we go. I'm. Uh, I'm going to go with the spore mushrooms, first of all, and I'm going to use those on the ogres as I see them, because I want to take command of them, and I want them to um, to fight for me. Um, so we'll see how that goes. I don't know. Uh, Ring of Lightning, which I, I don't really use very often, and um, I want to use the uh, the secondary ability on it, which is which is quite good. It's like a like a lightning a lightning storm that kills a lot of people and lasts for like 20 seconds. Let's grab the uh, Clockwork Mace. We'll also get the Spring Trap. We'll get the Extended Air Wall. We'll get the Sticky Tar Trap. Um, Steve's, which we're going to need for this one as well. Um, let's get the Floor Scorcher, which is a, a new item in the DLC, uh, which is which is also quite good. And uh, we're going to grab some barricades. And we're not going to uh, we're not going to barricade off one side or anything. Try to funnel them through. We're going to use these in the Rift Room back here, and that's because there's lots of runners in this, and we want to sort of um, slow them down as much as we can to give us time to actually kill them so they don't get in the rift. So that's the loadout. Um, I'm going to start by setting up some Steves back here. I'm going to set up two Steves. Um, no, sorry. I'm just going to set up one Steve for now. And uh, I'm going to get my uh, my uh, swinging mace traps set up either side there. So that's a, that's a huge spend uh, right away. Um, but it's also uh, also fairly sensible, I think, because uh, we don't want to have to fight them later. So this first wave, I've just started because I want to get, I want to try to get five skulls. So I'm just uh, I'm just going for it. We got Steve up there, so we don't need to worry. Let's get this penny. Let's see if we can hit this little bastard who doesn't really know where he's going. That's fine. And, and, and this one, oh my god, here they come. So let's uh, let's get the lightning storm down. And uh, this guy's just sort of beelining for Steve. And uh, that's not not overly good, but uh, let's try to blow him up a little bit if we can. Try to get intercept this guy. And oh my God, Steve! Steve, what has happened to you? He's coming after me now. This is a bit messy, but luckily we put that down and killed the. Uh, oh my goodness, God, that was really messy. Poor Steve is a uh, bit in the dust, but that's okay. We'll get another one. First wave's always a little bit sort of crazy, and um, second wave is also going to be a bit hairy because we've got lots of orcs coming out either side now. So what we're going to do is uh, try to kill as many of them on this side as we can with our uh, Ring of Lightning. Make my way back over here and uh, try to thin them out a little bit if we can. And uh, I'm just waiting for the Ring of Lightning to recharge so that I can kill more of them this side. Looks like it's done it. Make my way back up here where they should be coming through. Get the swing Mace. There's not too many of them now. And uh, we should have some help from Steve. Hopefully we don't get overwhelmed. Uh, we don't seem to be doing too bad. Although, I say that, poor Steve's getting wailed on back there again. And uh, I'm just going to shoot very fast. Try to kill these guys. One more. 
and that's fine. God, this is very messy. This is very messy indeed. So what I'm going to do now is get some uh, <laughs> some sticky tar traps down. I'm going to get them in the middle here, and uh, I'm also going to get them in the middle here. Slow them down so that these um, clockwork maces can, can do their job. And uh, once we get the kill zone set up on either side up here, we should be good. But uh, until then, it's going to be a bit touch and go. So um, I'm going to really have to grab ass and uh, hope for the best. Obviously, uh, both Steves got killed <laughs> along the way. Once by the, one of those bastards, and the other time by uh, just too many orcs. So there we go. Clockwork Mace doing some uh, fantastic work either side. And uh, we can just sort of strafe around, get some headshots, or uh, gut shots in this case. And there we go. We got a little bit of a break. Let's, uh, let's sell these up and uh, pad things out a bit more here with all of our money. Got tons of money. So we'll get some there, and we'll also get some tar traps here for the uh, for the maces. And uh, let's also get some floor scorchers as well. This is going to be the second part of our our little uh, our little kill zone. So we'll get them set up here and here. We'll get another one set up over here. Uh, and then another one there eventually. And then what we're going to do with the spring traps uh, is set them up behind the scorchers so that if anything does get through, they'll just get sprung back into this area and, uh, and, and get killed all over again. So it'll be like a double barbecue. And uh, everyone loves a barbecue, especially a double barbecue. So uh, let's get our ring of lightning down. Let's try to kill some of these guys. Here come some runners. The side two, which I'm going to try to intercept. The Steve's to help me. I'm eventually going to get some barricades set up in here, along here, and then uh, I'll have a little, uh, like a one square entrance to to those sets of barricades um, with a with a tar trap, and that's for these runners. Because as you can see, despite uh, there being a lot of traps set up and stuff, yeah, the runners are still getting through, and uh, it's getting a bit explosive either side. That's because the sappers are coming through and uh, and and detonating and killing everybody that's around them. There we go. Just gonna recharge a little bit here, and um, let's get that barricade set up straight away while we've got the money. So we want barricades here and here, and we want barricades here. Oh, just ran out of money, but that's okay. Eventually, we're gonna start getting ogres too. So I'm gonna start saving up some money for spore mushrooms because I want those guys on my side. Let's get the lightning ring down here. I keep calling it lightning ring, but it's a it's a ring of lightning, and uh, that should kill a couple of them. Should be good. Get a couple of uh, <laughs> chain kills there. We need that other floor scorcher too. And uh, this is where the barricades are going to work out quite well. Because see these runners? They're sort of getting caught up. They don't know. Sappers should never really get through to here and be able to uh, to ice the barricades. Oh my god. It's just... <laughs> Lord. Oh my god. I, as I say that, a sapper gets through and ices one of the barricades. Fantastic. Okay. So... Last barricade, and then we'll get this sticky tar trap in the middle here. So now we can slow them down, and it'll give us enough time to sort of react. I've got just enough money left uh, for some spore mushrooms. So I'm going to wait for one of those fire ogres to get up here, and then eventually I'll get another floor scorcher and some arrow walls. Running out of waves, though. I mean, it's uh, wave six already of nine. There's only nine waves in this level, and uh, we're sort of used to uh, there being 12. But, uh, but it's nice. It's nice to have a little break. So if this guy gets through, which he most certainly will, and uh, on the other side too, we'll uh, we'll uh, take control of him, and we'll call him something fun. There we go. And we'll let him wail away on the other one, and uh, hopefully anything else that comes through. And uh, just for good measure, let's also get that down. And uh, these guys are cleaving the hell out of my barricades. That's, that's not going too well. Okay, we should be should be good here. Oh, fantastic. So we've got uh, we've got our very own fire ogre here, which we'll call uh, Walter, and um, let's bring it on. I mean, we're doing pretty good. We're doing pretty good, right? Let's get the spring trap set up. We're gonna need them for these fucking bastards that are coming through. Want to go here too? And check this out. Once these uh, guys, are g they're gonna come running for the Steves. They're gonna get scorched, and then flee. Oh no! I thought they get flung by the spring traps, but it didn't quite work out. But it's okay. We got Walter to uh, help us out in there. Look, one of the runners got flung back anyway, which worked out pretty good. Let's get some of this action in here. Out of mana now, but 
It doesn't matter. God, poor Walter's getting pelted on. <laughs> and uh, stuff is getting flown, flung back from the spring traps into our little uh, kill zone, which is really good. And uh, I'm just going to pick up my pennies. Well-deserved pennies, I think. Um, so with my money now, let's uh, also get some arrow walls to sort of uh, beef things up in the kill zone a little bit. On this side, anyway. Uh, once we get some more money, do it on the other side, too. Uh, so I'm just going to wait for them to get up here before I use my uh, Ring of Lightning. Uh, because I want to kill everything sort of centrally. Um, for no other reason other than to, uh, to watch lots of stuff explode. And watch lots of guts and stuff flying all over the place. Because, damn it, I love watching um, orcs get, get killed and smushed and, uh, and barbecued. Um, it's it's sort of like riding a motorcycle with your mouth open. You don't want to uh, you don't want to be in too much awe while all this is going on, because there's lots of little body parts flying all over the place. And uh, oh god damn, here comes one of these guys. Let's see if we can uh, weaken him substantially. And we got uh, Walter doing some fairly good work. And uh, oh, fantastic! Walter's still going. Can you believe that? He's like an unstoppable beast from hell. Okay, great. I haven't actually upgraded anything, um, and I don't think I'm going to need to because we're on the last wave now. I've done fairly well with the trap set up. I haven't let anything through yet, and uh, god damn it, I hope I get five skulls. This doesn't earn me five skulls, I don't know what the hell will. But, uh, but there we go, that guy just threw his shield. Obviously he's just given up, and um, we might be able to get like a wife for Walter. Uh, Wal Walter Edda. If uh, if one can uh, can manage to break through, let's uh, let's hope that day comes. We can have like a proper ceremony, like a wedding. They can get married, and uh, oh my God, Walter's dead. It's not going to happen because Walter has just died. I'm out of money, and uh, these spore mushrooms are not recharging nearly as fast enough. Hopefully, these guys don't get through. Oh my God, this could be a problem. Okay, we got one. Poor Steve's getting killed. Oops, I really need to get this off. This could be a bit hairy. Please don't enter the rift. And uh, we could really do with some backup Walter down here. Oh my goodness. Oh. Oh. Oh my god. This is... Uh, this is really something. This is going right down to the wire. Oh my goodness. Oh god. So hairy at the end. Too many ogres, not enough spore mushrooms. Always the way. But we got the victory. And fuck yeah, five skulls. What do you think of that? That wasn't too bad. That setup wasn't too bad. Um, very good for the waves of orcs and stuff. Not so good for the ogres. Uh, but then again, if I'd, uh, if I'd saved a bit of money for the spore mushrooms at the end, for the extra spore mushrooms, and not gotten those extra sticky tar traps, it would have been fine. Uh, let's see how we did score-wise. I don't think we did too badly. Oh boy, check that out. I, I couldn't beat the guy on top because that score is just um, is, is cheating. But I beat Bully Bullseye, uh, who's my new arch nemesis, and I beat the uh, as well. Uh, Lalna's given up, I guess. He just got sick of the DLC because uh, he's a bastard. But um, don't tell him I said that anyway. And... Um, and yeah, that was episode 28. Sorry, um, sorry, I'd already finished it and uh, and retried it, but that's the way it goes sometimes. I hope you enjoyed my uh, my strategy for that one. Um, I think I used the traps quite well there, and uh, it got a little bit hairy at at, at a couple of moments, but um, we did okay. We got five skulls, and that's the main thing. So um, that's it. That was it. That was it. That was uh, episode 28. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already, and uh, I'll catch you for the next one.